Hey, joining us today to talk about the new OVP Foundation for Healthier Communities is the president, Sarah Walling, and director of development and community engagement, Velma Workman. So thank you all for stopping by. Thank you. Lots of exciting things to talk about. So tell us why this foundation was recently created. At OVP Health, we we work with mostly small rural communities throughout our region. Mm -hmm. And when you're working with communities that size, healthcare is really a part of the infrastructure. And so we realize that those communities have needs that aren't necessarily what you think about as traditional healthcare. And so we wanted to be able to help with those things too. Okay, and the OVP Foundation for Healthier Communities has identified some major areas of focus. So talk about these. We have three main programs this year. Our first is what we call Removing Recovery Roadblocks. And as we're working with patients who are experiencing substance use disorder, we see that they need GED classes. They may have a pet they need to have boarded. They may need job training. So that program works to remove any, any roadblocks to a successful recovery. Nice. Yeah. Uh -huh. The second one we call communities in crisis. And, and as I mentioned, as part of that infrastructure, we've seen some of our communities have just unspeakable tragedies, whether it was flooding in Eastern Kentucky, law enforcement involved shooting in Prestonsburg, or even the child childhood and adolescent mental health crisis that we see right now. Mm -hmm. We wanted to be able to help with those things and, and that's what that program does. And then the third program is what we call OVP Cares. We've been doing that for a couple of years. We serve lunch at Harmony House. We partner with the food bank to do food distributions mm -hmm. at our outpatient offices and, and this is really just an extension of those efforts. Oh, okay. Now something that I think you can really get the community involved in, you all have some events coming up to help raise some funds. Talk about we these. We do. Our first event this year will be on May 8th and we're uh, hosting a golf event uh -huh. called the uh, OVP Foundation Community Classic. We're okay. inviting all of our businesses that we deal with on a regular basis and inside of our communities to join us and this will be used to help break down barriers okay. to the recovery for our, our patients. Uh -huh. The second will be a back to school event where we'll be able to fill backpacks for schools. Oh, and that's help. so nice. This falls under the OVP Cares side. Uh -huh. And then the third one will be a, we're hosting a New Year's Eve ball this Ooh, year. Oh, how fun. We figured that would bring out a lot of different people and a lot of people could engage and help us help our patients. Uh-huh. And something brand new we've never seen before. Right. You all have a new mascot. We do. Super excited yeah, about this. In. Oh my goodness. Oh, see, 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 see. Here. <laughs> <laughs> Introduce us. This is OVP Otter. Uh -huh. We will be doing a lot of mental health with children this year. So uh -huh. we wanted to engage a mascot to have family friendly atmosphere. Uh -huh. um, we know that kids love mascots and they all fly to they them. They do. And he just has a good presence. Uh huh. When we do our pediatric mental health counseling. We're going to give each one oh, an OVP honor. How cute. So we'd like you to have one today too. Oh, thank you. <laughs> These are adorable and what a great way to connect with kids. Yes. Yes. That is wonderful, and to, and to spread the message there. You'll see OV out in the community starting uh -huh. soon. I think we're at the United Way event on May, March 11th. And uh -huh. then we're just going to take him around to different schools and introduce him and let everyone know that Mental yeah. health isn't scary. You're going to be busy <laughs> having fun with the kids and yes. spreading that message there. Okay, before we let you go, I know uh, if viewers are wanting to find out more about the events and the, the services that you all offer, or maybe they want to get involved in some of these events, what's a good way for them to get in touch with you all? You can contact me at 304-429-1088 or just call any OVP office and they can get you in touch with us. There's all the information right there. Sarah and Velma and your new co-worker yeah. here. Okay. Ovi, thank you all for stopping by today. Thank you for having us. We appreciate it. Do you want to wave goodbye? <laughs>